Okay, hello and welcome. How are you doing? Next, I like to show you that how to install this engine block heater. And here I have one heater example, and there is many kind of heaters in in sales in Europe and in US. And in US, there there is those like auto auto part and auto store part online. There is many heaters in in many cars and like generic heaters for fits in this outside of this engine body. That is the idea. That all of those heaters they they must install in this outside of this body. Okay, and then when we, when we are planning to install this block out heater like in that way. This block out heater is by the way made in Sweden and this name is brand is Teva and it's 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 uh, it's planned for especially in this Toyota VVTi engine that it fits in here quite well like in there is it it fits there like in very nicely in these holes there are those holes and here are those pumpy things and they fits in excellently in here and there is idea that that when we install this block out heater that this heater must be so well fit and so tight against in this engine body than possible if if we could could weld this part in totally in here or glue well it is the better because there is idea that this part becomes really hot like 200 celsius temperature settings and this is really hot if i touch that in 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 this way when this electric is on i burn my fingers because this is so hot and then it start to heat up this engine body and then this our engine becomes warm and and in in the in winter mornings this engine stop up better and and also this car don't don't eat so much gasoline and petrol when when this is warm and if if engine is cold and very uh, icy then this engine consume more gasoline and then there is the third very important thing that when we heat up this engine block also those engine engine inside parts like bearings and pistons they don't burn out so much than in icy and frozen situation. There is three excellent things. Okay, and then this installation. How to install this block out this heater? It happens so that first we purchase in some kind of this heater, and then if we are lucky, we can purchase in just like in special design in this Toyota body like this Swedish Teva product. But in US we have generic block out heaters what fits in, in any cars and any place and, and then we can install that in in this place and then second thing is that we need to have some support brace or the support bar what we install in some bolt hole in here. This like this Toyota's uh, engine block is full of those ready bolt holes in here. Like in here, 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 and then we can loan something those old bolt bars. And now I think that I I could install that my block heater. This is the best part. What this this dealer has been plan. And first I saw that part, and next I. Uh, so other part what could suit also and then here is, is my support bar and bolt and then I install that in here and there is also small tap and this small bolt in here that I can install that hole hole in directly in there okay and this, this way then I start to fasten this bolt Ok, 
Okay. Now, now I'll put this in here. So, and now this block in heater, it has been installed in here. And then we need to only check that is this enough to tighten in here, that it is not loosened. And then we have this special cable, electric wire, what we hook up in that part. And the other part goes to this, our house, electric cable, this uh, hole. And, and now this this outer, outer this heater is ready for using and of course if you like to use some special aluminium paste in between this this part and any engine block then this heating process can work even better but this is this is now quite well and then I saw that if you purchase some some generic heater that how to install those and this is like again example I open first that bolt in here okay and then I think that I like to install that part in here and let's look at what it happens first in I, I check that what might be good position, like in something like that. Okay, good. And then I first install this my support bolt in here, in here, and let it moment. Okay, and then I think that. Some, some, some place in here. And that place could be good. Okay. Let's check the what, how, how I could manage that. Okay, this is like, like that way. Okay, good. This is quite okay. Okay. And if I have big engine bay like in four trucks like F415, there is huge amount of place that I can install this in here. This is my This is this is other way to install. It is also in fasten in there, and then there is possibility if you uh, if you like to tune up your engines in really well water, like in Alaska or North Pole or South Pole fix. You can install these heaters in like three: one in here, one in here, one in here, and fourth in here in fourth heaters, and then this engine is quite hot when you start in morning that it is possible to install this more in here in different places and then we have much more warmer engine i have planned to install sometimes that i i might install two heaters but but it is my future plan okay and this was this information how to install this block art heater and thank you for watching this video